do is we're going to work some more upper body based takedowns. So a lot of times we've worked on hitting, you know, hey, here's a single leg, double leg, really changing levels hard and getting under people to be able to take them down. Today we're going to work on a little bit more upper body, chest to chest, more almost like Greco Roman style takedown. So I'm here, one, two, three. Now as I hit this two, I'm going to step my right leg in between. Because I'm going to be fading out to my left side as I'm hitting these jabs. As I throw this right here, I'm going to step my legs in between. Here. All we're going to do at that point, drive our foot and our knee chest forward. So we're here. One, two, three. Bop, bop. Diversion, 20% landing. You're not looking for this to be like that digging overhand that not to be black. This is a, hey, your hands should be up, just get up. <laughs> See what I mean? That's what we want this to be is, hey, up close magic. The thing I love most in this sport outside of my children. It brings me so much joy. Up close magic when people are like, woo, look at this. Bop, bop, bop. I throw the overhand, stepping in, hooking, driving through. Questions on this? Give it a try. This is going to be the hardest one we work today, but I want to start out with it, see if you guys get a good feel for it. One, two. So I'm here. I hit my jab, jab, jab. Now I'm going to hit this two here. Tuesday, we're working, come into that body and chopping that leg. We're still going to come to that body, but then he's going to be looking to base that leg hard because he's thinking that's coming this side. So all we're going to do on here, one, two, three, two, three. I'm going to step forward. Okay. All right. So I'm looking to wrap body side low with this hand, digging under it with this side. One. Three, two, body, ten. Ten. Once I'm here, arm trapped, arm not trapped. Not a big detail. Hopefully you can get this arm trapped. And all we're doing is sitting him over our left. Just a little simple back trip. Simple but effective takedown. Especially upper body, especially open space. So I'm here, one, two, three, two, body, set. Alright. Now, 30 south balls. 30 south balls is good for any my gym for some reason. Or actually I'm the dirty south. Damn it. So, 30 to bed. Five, five, two. You're still coming body. You're just gonna body lock to the outside. So I'm here, pop, 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 setting it down. Questions on that? We do the same. You do the same. So if you're ortho fighting the south ball, one, two, three. Step over hard. 
because the goal is going to be to hit that overhand, step through, almost like you're hitting a clothesline shot here, 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 and throw it. I was ready. <laughs> so, I'm here, bop, 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 step, hit. Now, he's going to be defensively cracked. He's going to go grab in here. Step it through for all the headlock. So I'm here. Bop, bop, bop. Nice step. Okay. He's going to start to drive in. Turn. Whipping grip. Now, once you get here, you want to turn in pretty quickly. Because you don't want to leave that underhook available. So you want to turn back into it. But overall, trying to grab the head, grab the arm. Question. Yeah, break fall. <laughs> most of you have to do the last 20 years. Questions on that? South Keys. South Keys. So if I'm the ortho fighting the South Keys, I'm, I'm a good person. Bop, bop, bop. It's more of a clothesline into that front line. Now, if I'm the South Easy fighting the Ortho Fighter, bop, 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 bop. It's more of a back trip clothesline than it is going to be ahead. You know that you like sweet. You've seen me do this. I felt like you should have been something like that. Yeah. Bop. You've seen me do that. You hit it with almost like a running man. So when I'm here, bop, bop, bop. As I shoot that too, I'm driving back. 